Hi everyone, today we are going to be watching Annabelle. <coughs> okay, my voice just disappeared. Today we are going to be watching Annabelle. Literally every time I try to say the name, my voice disappears. <coughs> Annabelle. Okay. Already, already we're at a creepy start. Today we are going to be watching Annabelle. Creepy doll movies are probably my least favorite slash the ones I'm the most afraid of because of Chucky, which I never watched when I was little. I just ran away anytime it was on TV. So I'm pretty nervous about watching this one, but I know it's in the Conjuring universe. So we're just gonna go ahead and watch it. Oh, I'm so nervous. <laughs> I'm so nervous. <laughs> this one I had to watch in the daytime. It is nice and sunny out right now. It's beautiful. I'm gonna go outside and enjoy the fall weather after I finish this movie because I can't even look at her face. Her face is like looking at me right now on the screen and I can't. All right, let's start watching. Since the beginning of civilization, dolls have been beloved by children, cherished by collectors, and used in religious rites as conduits for good and evil. One of those things is not like the other. But then things got worse. This is the exact scene from The Conjuring. It was a gift from my mom for my birthday. I don't know where she got it. I wanna pause it, but I don't wanna pause it when she's on the screen. <laughs> okay. Okay, perfect. I was gonna say, are we gonna actually see those three characters now? Is it gonna be their story? Because when I was watching The Conjuring, I thought it was gonna be about those three people and then they just disappeared. Well, they only lost their daughter two years ago. She ran away and joined up with the hippies. <laughs> oh, you, you didn't lock it? No, why would I? That's gonna be super important. Someone's gonna break into their home. No behavior. Oh gosh, be careful, be careful. Look down, why are you? Waiting charges. <laughs> <laughs> More again? Okay. We cut away from her good. You think you could shut off the TV? It's making it a little hard to concentrate. Their leader, Charles Manson. Okay, so this is the second references to cults. And we have the door being open. Is a cult gonna break in? Look at all those dolls in the background. Oh my god, there's even more! <laughs> they keep multiplying. There's more on the other side of the wall. I swear, if she has more dolls on the other side, on the back wall. There's something I want to give you. Okay, close your eyes. Is it gonna be Annabelle? Oh, oh that's a I was waiting big box. On this. <laughs> it is Annabelle. It's way bigger than I thought it was. I thought it was like this small. Where did you find her? I mean, uh, do you know how long I've been looking? I know. <laughs> I'd completely lost hope. Is it like a collector's doll? You know what, she doesn't actually look that creepy. Also, I wore white to match with Annabelle, so... <laughs> You'll be a little short on the rent the next few months. There's... Why? She has so many dolls. There were more dolls on the other side, on the other wall. She's huge. <laughs> like, she's so tall. I really thought she was like one of those dolls that you can like... Oh, this is so cool. So someone broke into their house? <laughs> I, I loved how that was shot. Oh my god. I hope they close the door. John? Keep your door locked. Hello. Hopefully he can run back quickly. Oh my god, you're go covered in blood. It's not mine, it's not. Go back inside and call an ambulance right now. Be careful, what if they're in your house? You left the door open. Oh my god, hurry up, hurry up. 911, hurry up. Dial those numbers, girl. Don't look around. I need, I need an ambulance. 307 Garden Road. <laughs> you had to close the door. Oh no. Oh, they were in the in the doll room. No, no, no. Don't look at her. Maybe if you don't see her, she'll just go away. You can have them. My husband's coming back. Just, just take whatever you Who are these people? <laughs> Get out! Get out of here, Mia! I don't think she can walk right now. <laughs> and now I feel bad that I'm wearing white because of all these freaking people murdering everyone wearing white. <laughs> I just wanted to match Annabelle. <laughs> Where's the ambulance, though? 
Okay, there they are. Ambulance is wearing white. We're back to good decision to wear a white shirt. <laughs> oh, so creepy. Now I feel bad for the doll. Was the doll just like a regular doll living its life as a, <laughs> as a toy? Oh, gross. I think that's what it was. It was just normal doll and then... A man and his wife were brutally stabbed to death by their estranged daughter, Annabelle Higgins, and her unidentified boyfriend. What? So Annabelle was the daughter of them, and she was a real person. In this movie, I mean. I am putting you on bed rest for the remainder of your pregnancy now. Wow. I was not expecting Annabelle to be the daughter. And I wasn't expecting the daughter to be the one who broke into the house. Wow. But if something does happen, you'll save the baby over me. You promised me you saved the baby. So we're now assuming that she's gonna die at the end of this? What the hell is that? John? In Insidious, I was talking about how the people needed to grab like a book or something as a weapon and he immediately had a bat just under his bed. Okay. <laughs> I guess that's a good makeshift weapon. Oh, especially after what happened to them. Definitely they'd need to have something on hand. <gasps> it's the sewing machine. Imagine you look down and it's just little Annabelle dog, like, sitting on the pedal. <laughs> I hope she's feeling like she's like a little mafia boss, just like rocking back and forth in her chair. <laughs> she, she stopped rocking as soon as she came in. She heard you. She knew the chair was rocking. Okay, Annabelle isn't scaring me so far because she hasn't done anything evil. She's just been rocking her chair and trying to like make a dress or something. Yeah, thinks I've got a real shot at Huntington Memorial. Of course you do. It's in Pasadena though. So there's this one day okay. conference in Sac. Oh my goodness. Wait, wait, this is so cool. Wait, oh gosh. Let's see if you can see this. Hi, bud. I put a steps outside so that um, I could film. And he climbed up the steps, but now there's nowhere to go. <laughs> All right, he's settled in. And he's gone. Okay, let's keep watching the movie. If the doll moves, I'll get creeped out. So far, it's acting like a real doll, like it's not moving around or anything. Please, okay. I was worried it was gonna start moving, so I'm good. Oh, you can't just throw out a doll like that. If Toy Story taught me anything, <laughs> it's to treat your doll, your toys with respect. Okay, that shot lingered on the popcorn for too long, so something's gonna happen with the popcorn. I hope it's popped when they wake up the next day. It's just ready to eat. Oh my gosh. Something is definitely gonna happen with her fingers in that sewing machine because they keep doing way too many close-up shots of that. Oh my god, be careful. Oh my god, so much is happening. <laughs> the popcorn's about to pop. Her fingers are gonna be sewn into that. Look, uh. I told you, I leave, leave. <gasps> Come on, pop. <gasps> I didn't mean it that way. I meant, I thought the popcorn was gonna start making the popping sounds, the kernels. Okay, now Annabelle is creepy because now she's fully trying to murder them. <gasps> what? Get out of the house. That's it. Just get out of the house. <gasps> oh, her baby. <sighs> Something just dragged her. It's a girl. This is my baby. It's like the houses are cursed. I can never go back there. I can't. I can't not with her. No. You don't have to. He got the residency. They're moving. Yep. Pasadena. So this is another case where they moved, but whatever entity was there is still following them. Get all those moving boxes. I'm worried Annabelle's gonna be in one of those. She's gonna be in there. She's like, hello. <laughs> Surprise. Ooh, her eyebrows. Does she always have those eyebrows? They're so intense. Wait a sec, how, how did that get in there? I swear, I threw it out. Here, give her to me. You gave her to me as a gift. You sure? Yeah. That tilted shot, I think it's called a, a Dutch angle, while she was holding the doll. Feels suspicious. Okay, she's starting to look creepy, but I don't know why. Cause she looked she looked fine before. She wasn't creepy at all. 
You see? I feel like she didn't have those eyebrows. Maybe she was just more dirty. You just gotta clean her up a little bit. <gasps> That's not the doll anymore. Who is that? <gasps> Wake up! I thought this was strictly a doll movie. I thought we were gonna see Annabelle walking around. That's the, the, the girl whose blood went into Annabelle. What's your name? It's me. I said don't tell her. Maybe one day we can all be friends. Uh. <laughs> I like him. He's just like, we're not talking to any strangers here. We're not messing with that. Look at this. Oh no, <laughs> they're gonna progressively get more gruesome. And now they're falling from the sky. Now they're threatening her. If Leah did something like this, I, I would want to know about it. Leah would never do anything like this. This isn't even good. I mean, look at the proportion. Oh, John. Are the kids even real? What if they don't exist? I thought I saw something in the reflection of the picture right there. The picture above the record player. I don't think there's anyone there. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god, that's not the doll. What is that? <laughs> close, close the <laughs> oh, it's like shape shifting. Oh, I wish you were on the first floor. I would tell you just run out that window. Oh wait, you have a child. <laughs> you can't just abandon your child in there. I can't get over how big she is. She's so tall. Her legs are like hanging over. Ugh. She's literally just sitting like occupying as much room as possible. No, she's not. She's just sitting like normal, <laughs> but it just feels imposing. Please don't move your head. <sighs> it's the loud noises. <laughs> it's the loud noises. Oh no. Oh no. It's not gonna be a baby in there. Some type of evil shape-shifting creature thing that it's doing again. No. No. Hurry up, hurry up, close, 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 Okay. Oh shoot, close again, close again. Press down on the button that says hold doors closed. No. Oh no. I guess it's telling you to get out of the elevator. Oh god, okay. Yes, 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 hook it, hook it, hook it. <laughs> Run. Keep going up, do not look back and just keep going up. Anyway, A for Annabelle, um, also A for Avengers is what my brain was trying to connect because that looks exactly like the Avengers logo. I did find that their act wasn't devotional. They were actually trying to conjure something up. Conjuring? <laughs> it doesn't really matter anyway. Why not? Well, because this is all just a bunch of hocus pocus. Hocus pocus? <laughs> wow, we're really throwing out like all the movies I've watched this October, huh? The truck scene, the truck scene. Grab your, your oh my God, the truck. Oh wow. They purposely framed it in a way that we didn't see that she had the baby. She was holding onto the baby until that very scene. In the corner. Oh my god, she's standing up. She's moving finally. Look how tall she is. She can look out the window. Oh, and now she's floating. Soul needs to be offered to the demon before he can take it. At the very least, I've heard of a married couple that the church has worked with in the past. Oh, I'm pretty sure he's talking about the Warrens from The Conjuring. Perhaps if she's stored in a sacred place, it will weaken the demon enough it won't have the strength to return. I hope he's okay. Oh no, he's getting in a car. No, keep it in view so you can look at it. What if it like jumps up and strangles you or something because it's in the back seat? Please don't move. The doll, please don't move doll. Okay. Ew. <laughs> Ew. Ew. It's so red. Is he gonna try to put her in a church? Is it even gonna be able to walk in there? Like get in- Ew. Ew. <laughs> hurry up, hurry up, get in there. Get in there, hurry up, get in. Get in, hurry up, get in, please. <laughs> okay, new tactic. If you are still alive and can get up. Oh no, I see a lot of blood over there. Oh no, he's dead, isn't he? I was gonna say a new tactic would be to just throw the doll in, into the church. That way you don't have to go flying back to, and you could just let the doll do its thing. See if it makes it. <laughs> See if it lands inside the church or bounces back. He's alive! 
Oh, I thought he was dead. Oh, I'm so glad he survived. Okay. <laughs> I think this is the first movie I've watched this holiday, holiday season, this Halloween season, where the jump scares are actually getting me. They're actually freaking me out. <laughs> The crayon! That was at the start of The Conjuring and then she wrote all over the walls. Her soul. <laughs> Alright, thanks for spelling it out for us. Annabelle's like, I'm your baby now. <laughs> your soul? No thank you. I wonder if she'll do it because she's thinking like maybe in exchange for the soul of, of her daughter, she'll give up her own soul. Oh my god, they're at the top floor. I was hoping they were on the first floor. Oh, she even said at the start of the movie, she was like, if anything were to happen, save the daughter, don't save her. I want her soul. I have to get mine, John. Mia, no. Don't do it. How about no one gives anyone their soul? Everyone just keeps their own soul, and that's that's better. A daughter needs her mother. So you said it needs a soul. Please. Please let me save her. I don't to think about this. <gasps> She's going to sacrifice her own soul. I don't know why everyone's so willing to get rid of their souls. <laughs> I can make it right. You see... Uh, no, no. No. But what was the point of that? Like, why give her a soul? Wouldn't that just make her more powerful? Or, or like, I feel like one soul wouldn't be enough for, for a creature like that, like an evil entity. Six months later. I just pray that whoever comes into contact with the doll necks gets the help they need. Is that it? What about those three kids from the start of the film? I'm still waiting to hear their story. Anything I can help you with? Oh, I'm just trying to find something for my daughter. She's a nurse. Always helping people. That's them. We looked everywhere for one of these. It's a collector's item, supposedly. Do you see the Raggedy Ann in the corner? I feel like I heard somewhere that the actual, like, if there's a... I don't know if this is true. If there's, like, a based on a true story type of thing. Because I didn't see that message. The actual Annabelle is, like, that one, not, like, this creepy doll over here. I feel like I read that somewhere. It's a collector's item, supposedly. That's why we price it a little higher than the rest. You want me to ring it up? Also, why would you gift your daughter that? Why would you gift anyone that? It's so creepy and dirty. Please don't move. Okay. <laughs> well, I've been waiting on those three kids who were at the start of the movie. I thought the Conjuring story was going to be about them, and then I thought this story was going to be about them because they popped up. I know there's a few more Annabelle movies, so maybe at one point they appear because I kind of want to hear their story now. They keep popping up. All right. Oh, so creepy. <laughs> Just her face. Okay. All right. Well, I'd like to say that was fun, but it, it was just creepy. <laughs> it was very creepy. Anyway, <laughs> I'm gonna move my mouse away so that we're on. I was like, I'm gonna move my mouse away so we're not looking at Annabelle, but then there's a bunch more Annabelle movies down below. So uh, we'll just switch the tab. Wow, how beautiful. <laughs> Hawaii. Well, I am very creeped out now. Um, so, <laughs> so that's it. It's nice and bright outside still. So I'm gonna maybe go for a walk. <laughs> and I think this is the last movie for like spooky season. And then we're gonna move on to some fun, not so spooky stuff for the next month. All right, so feel free to like and subscribe and thank you for watching. Bye.